not really digging the lighting, but it's Halloween, so why not? Um, welcome back to the channel, everyone. Today we're checking out another Ginger video. It came out yesterday. Um, it's called Pit of Consciousness. And, yeah, for the thumbnail, it looks very spooky, Halloween-themed. I think their album is out now. Um, uh, there's a little message here. Let me read this. This is a song that could be applied to each of us in the band, living a life at full pace after years of tour touring. Have we accidentally let someone else in our heads become foreigners to ourselves, holding on to the hope that we can keep those doors shut? Interesting. So I guess it's going to be about, like, you know, other other bands have talked about this. Um, you know, and anyone with... Uh, amount of fame early um how you know there's there's a real you and then there's like the persona you that you put on when you're performing um and i totally get that um <laughs> i think i think any of us anyone really um can understand that but uh in particular people that have to perform for a living um so you know artists um actors you know all that all that kind of stuff. anyways let's just get into the song and see what it sounds like They're all such talented artists, musicians. Their, their genre just is so, it's metal, but they just are able to interweave it with other genres so seamlessly. I don't know if I'd call like progressive rock maybe for this song. I love these special effects too. Such hypnotic music. <laughs> Just getting lost in it. I'm sorry, not talking too much. Stop on a dime.
okay. <laughs> so yeah, um, I could see that. I could see the the way they're, you know, some of the lyrics applying to sort of just being lost in your own mind and how sometimes you don't know, you know, like trying to let yourself out basically. And I, I think the visuals kind of follow that too, where she's just laying in a field, um, thunderstorm raging around her. And then eventually she falls into water and starts drowning, you know, um, how if we're not careful, we can get overcome by what kind of roles we have to play in our lives. Um, maybe I'm projecting too much. Um, this one, I'm going to have to look up the lyrics because to be un to be fair, I'm not very good at listening or hearing the lyrics during the growling parts. But, you know, from the, from the little bits that I did understand, um, yeah, you know, there's, there's, I heard the part about like, uh, falling into un unconsciousness, um, and sort of just slipping away kind of, um, but yeah, I just, <laughs> I, I need to listen to their whole album. Um, let's see, get macro here. So it's out now. Yeah. So I'll probably <laughs> check them out. Um, I don't know. Should I check them out or should I wait for more videos? Um, cause so far I loved, um, uh, on the top and then judgment and punishment. That one I just it's just in my head for some reason. I just can't get it out of my head right now. Um, so if they're all like this level, um, it sounds like a definite must-have album. And I might actually have to go out and get a physical copy because I haven't gotten one two years. I haven't gotten a copy of any physical <laughs> CDs in like two years. Where can you buy CDs anymore? Anyways, um, leave a thought in the comments down below. What do you guys think of this song? Um, and what was I saying make anything sense? Did that sentence make any sense? Did anything that I say make sense? Do you feel like <laughs> it makes sense for this song? Um, and happy Halloween, everyone. Um, <laughs> it's coming out late, but whatever. I uh, hope you guys have a good night, good day, whenever you're watching this. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll check you out in the next video.